it's time to knock some things off your bucket list. First up, travel the world. If you've always wanted to visit Hong Kong or vacation in the Swiss Alps and wondered what it was like, well, Jeanette, Yvette, and Tina got the scoop for you. These jet-setting divas are always at some fun and exotic place experiencing the best of what life has to offer. And each week, they'll tell you all about it. These ladies are always high-flying loads of fun. Hey, everyone. I'm Jeanette. I'm Yvette. And I'm Tina. And we are the Jet Setting Divas. Hey, ladies. What's hey. going on? Hey. Part two, part two, part two. Yeah. Last week, we gave y'all the deets on Isma Muharis and Cancun. Now we're moving on to Playa del Carmen. Playa del Carmen. Oh, my gosh. That was so beautiful. I got to tell y'all, I was so excited. The water. The water was so beautiful. Blue. Mm -hmm. I mean, we've seen some beautiful water, but I can almost say, you know, Mexico, I Cancun, yeah. all, they had some beautiful water. Yeah. And I got to yeah. see it from a and I got to see it from parasailing, so I know. <laughs> okay, so you so, tell us about that later. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So so you know, Cancun usually have a problem with that seaweed, the sargasma. Mm -hmm. But if you go at this time of year, no problem. Uh -huh. It was wild. no problem. Yeah. So it's yeah, so so that's what made part of the water really, really pretty at this I'm time. I'm going every year, year at this time then. <laughs> Tell oh, us about no. that hotel that you found, Yvette. That resort. Yeah, oh, that was, was all wonderful. All inclusive, all food, all drinks that we enjoyed. Oh, my gosh, yes. Come on, yeah. tell us about it, Yvette. So, yeah, so we've gone to Mexico before, and we've stayed at the Reef Resorts. Um, we stayed at the all-adult place, Reef 28, before a couple of years ago. So this time, we chose to go to Playa Car, Reef Playa Car. Mm -hmm. and it was great it was all inclusive we got all of our food all of our drinks, drinks. and drinks and drinks and, drinks and, more, and drinks. more drinks oh my gosh <laughs> again, what three restaurants three or three <laughs> restaurants lots of yeah. Yeah. lots of little like outdoor poolside uh places to eat so it was you mm -hmm. were not missed by food and drink the whole time <laughs> no, no no not at we all when we arrived, they welcomed us with a welcome drink, which was really yes, nice that you always see on the housewife shows. We got yeah. that. We got yeah. our rooms and we got to go in. That's yeah, what we, we got did. we got yeah. moved. I think I don't even think we <laughs> I think we threw our stuff in that room and we went we went straight for the bar. Yes. <laughs> right, right. So, so the reef the reef is pretty cool because it's like a jungle. It's like yes. you're walking through a jungle. Yeah. It, it's like you you're in you're in Tulum, but you're not really in Tulum. So it's yeah. like it was just really nice. We got in the rooms. We opened up those suitcases. Got a swimsuit, and next yeah. thing you know, we was at the pool having we drinks was, and eating food. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because it wasn't really a you know our drive from from uh, Cancun to Playa del Carmen wasn't. You know, about an hour or an hour or so. Yeah. You know, not too yeah. bad. Yeah, I think so. You know, about an hour. So, mm -hmm. you know, we 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 hustled on down the road after we left that brunch and we we made it over um by, by check by check check in time. By check in time. So we definitely mm -hmm. um yep. we definitely we did um did a good thing there. One hack that I will give for if you were saying any resort. You always want to get, if, if there's a restaurant that you have to have reservations for, you want to get those reservations as soon as possible. So since we checked in at oh. 3 p.m., by the time well, we checked in, there weren't many well, choices. Yeah. yeah, we go ahead and tell me that we didn't have many choices right. when we checked right. in. So, so th this is this is pretty much standard at all all-inclusive resorts. You always make your reservations for the restaurant that, of your choice the morning of. So Early. of course we didn't get there to what three four o'clock. So we had to just take whatever <laughs> was yeah. available, you know, yeah. for that eve that evening. Yeah. But we so actually, th that's pretty yeah. much like at all places. Yeah, we actually did get a really nice restaurant though. It was in yeah. a, uh, mm -hmm. what was that? It was an Italian. Was it the first? Night? No, we didn't have Italian. Uh, we yeah, had, we had. Oh, I think well, it was. Yeah. It was, it was, it was it was, it was Mexican. Oh, it yeah. Mexican. And we made some locals. <laughs> yeah. yeah it, was the, the, it was really, really good. So I I, I think we uh, I think our, we all like the Bereas. I think that was our Berea yeah. spot. Yeah. So that was really, really good. And then, yeah. then from there, we, um you know, we hustled. We, you know, got us a couple of drinks. And we were there pretty late. We stayed there, you know, almost midnight, yeah. I think. Well, we went to the after party. That's oh, what we did. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> the, oh, yeah. We went to the rooftop bar. Yes. Right. 
at the reef plier car there's a rooftop bar so we went and it wasn't a whole lot of people there but we made fun <laughs> oh, yes. awesome, some good time fun you know had had our bartender had our drinks dance talk it was just a good time and i don't know how long did we stay there we stayed there until after midnight. That's what we stayed there. Yeah, we stayed there super long. Yeah, it was it was it was it was great. And then I think from there, so you know, the next day we had a kind of like I wouldn't call it a free day, but because I know yeah. I had a ball. You know, I think I, I I did a little work and play, but you know, I was able to get out there and hang out on the beach. We had some good breakfast. It was buffet style every morning. I had about five mimosas in, and then you know. Hey. So we split up. Tina, tell us what you did. Me and Yvette went together. We did one thing. Tell us what you did. Oh, yeah. So I went over to uh, Paracel. So they had, you know, uh, some jet skis over there. Say, we'll take you to Paracel. I never did it before. So, hey, got a, you know, one of the ladies went with me and we got on one of those Paracel, go on the boat and they took us away and I got to see the entire island. You know, Were from you the top scared? Of, no, I was scared. No. <laughs> I don't know. I don't have that fear. Yeah, you know, yeah. I, I don't know. I see people do that all the time, but I was, I was like, I don't know if I ever wanted to do. I did never have a desire to do it. Yeah, but I it looked like it was a whole time. lot of fun. It did look like it was so much fun. And yeah. then Yvette and I, we went over to the the Reef Thirty Eight or twenty thirty. Is it thirty eight or twenty eight, Yvette? Reef Thirty Eight. <laughs> look, I'm forgetting the name of it. Yeah, so, so we went over there and we were able to go to a spa that was absolutely wonderful. It had this e e eucalyptus room you could go into. Yeah. It was wonderful. The spa Th that was, was Jeanette loved that room. It was, it was like a steam room. It was a, they had, a they had to kick us out. Room. They had to kick us out. We <laughs> stayed until the very we, we kept saying we're gonna stay as long as we can. We were we were in the water, we were in the pool, we were in the sauna, we were just everywhere. Mm -hmm. And it was really yeah. it, so so that was your do what you want to do day. Yeah. So we went to like we did this hydrotherapy spa. Um, they had all of these machines that massage your back, get in the water, uh, all kind of different things that that was, you know, going on or what have you. And I enjoyed that water. It was very relaxing. It was very relaxing. We, we went into the sauna. And, and the thing about it is they escorted you to each yeah. place that you can go to, which was good because yeah. if you don't know what to do, you no. really, that was our first time there. Yeah. And we yeah. didn't know what to do. And you they take a shower, these. yeah. You take a yep. shower in between events. Yeah. E mm -hmm. Each the room you go into, you take a shower. And it's just so relaxing. It was just such a relaxing spa experience. And what did we pay for it, Yvette? Maybe forty dollars. I mean, it was 30, very, no. very was it thirty? It was thirty five dollars. Very, very affordable. So when yeah. you're in Mexico, don't sleep on going to the to the to a spa. And this spa was at Reef Reef 28. We were there. And one thing that I really did like about being at Reef 28 is that it's an adult only, adult only hotel or resort. And you're able to talk with the other other people that are the adults. It's, it's much more um, kind of a, you know, bar type vibe where you can, you can talk to people. We got some good, made, met some new friends and just had a really good time event. Yeah. Well, we actually met some people who were uh, locals. Well, yeah. they don't live. They didn't actually live there, but they lived there like four months out of the year. Mm -hmm. And a lot of people do that when they go to Mexico. You know, they go to Mexico and they stay. They say they don't want to be in the winter at home, and they go to Mexico and they say, you know what? I'm spending my winter where it's warm, nice, sunny, and there's a beach. I, I think that's pretty cool. You know, I if think you can so do too. that, you I know, think so too. do it. And what did we do next? We, we, we missed, we got a little bit of highlights of Tina parasailing and go on our social media and see her flying high in the air. What did we do next, event? What did we do that <laughs> night? We went, we went out and had, um, went to the Mexican uh, restaurant and then, no, because that's, that was oh, a, no, 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 no. Yeah. No, we went and partied at the, uh, you know, Plan del Carmen we did. Is known we went downtown. Their... I have senior moments. Yeah. We went downtown. So, <laughs> yeah. So so we went, we left the plier car area. And the plier car, um, just note that if you do go to a resort there, it's gated. So it's 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 a really safe area. It's we gated. Prior, you know, a lot My of battery went down. 
Beautiful Welcome back, homes. Tina. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, my battery was dead. No, it's okay. It happens. Yeah, I'm Welcome back. back. With, Hopefully, with, I didn't miss yeah. too much. No, you didn't miss too much. Okay, no. so we were just telling them about we went downtown. What was your highlight, Tina? We went downtown, and we, uh, well, you know what? We got some tequila. The, the, More the, tequila. The tequila. The tequila. The tequila. The tequila. The free tequila that they messed us over would mess me up, so we had to go get some real tequila. We had a lot of what they call it Mexican water. We had a lot of Mexican uh, water. Oh my God. So, we had a, yeah. We went see. down to the Fifth Avenue. That's what it's called. Oh, yeah. yeah. The apartment is beautiful the area. Where they have all the stores, the shops, the clubs, the bars, anything that you can ever think of. <laughs> yes. It's there. You can just walk and do whatever you want to do. Yeah, and I, I really like that. And you know so, what I also like is that even though the weather kind of got us, we you know we were able to find things. You know, you know, slip into one of the shops, slip into the pharmacy, slip into the you know <laughs> uh, a little restaurant, <laughs> and you know just kind of you know hang out and 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 make our move. And I you know don't really need a plan. So I think that was a really we just kind of went out there. Some people went shopping. Some people you know just wanted to hang out and have drinks. And it was just a good time to just kind of see the the city, you know, lots of vendors, yeah, good place to buy stuff. Yeah. Uh, and some of the bars. So what was the deal? We went to a couple of bars, and how they try to get you in is they tell you, "Come on, we're gonna get you a free drink. Come in, your first drink is free, free. right?" Yeah. The, yeah. That's what they was doing. The first to drink us, may right? be water, though. That yeah. first, that first place we went to it was water. <laughs> So we we got hip to the game. The second place, we said, just give us a shot. <laughs> don't yeah. even don't play with us. Just give us a yeah. shot. Yeah, and then we bought some bottles and we went back. You know yeah. that that's just a great place. I know you can go through duty free, but if you are planning to uh, check a bag, that's a definitely a good place to you know pick up some some authentic tequila or you know I know everybody was searching for something with a worm in it or something with a a scorpion in Ooh. it, but you know it was definitely yeah. a lot yeah. of different selections out there. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so we did cool. go. We did go to a tequila tasting at a tequila shop. Yeah, right. And they yeah, had yeah. tequila bottles with scorpions in it. They had yeah. tequila, uh, uh, tequila bottles with worms in it. We taste all kind of pistachio tequila, uh, just all kind of different coconut, flavors. Coconut, pineapple. And you all made some purchases. We oh, did. Yeah. We oh, did. Yeah. I had to we give Axe Tina some for her birthday. Yeah, <laughs> it was my birthday. So I definitely got yes. some sipping tequila as well as a coffee tequila. So that was, that's awesome. And mm -hmm. did y'all tell them how I whipped that truck into that parking space? That was something to talk about. How Come I got on, that. Tell us about it. Uh, tell look, us about hey, driving. I yes, backed I it in. I backed that big driving. old truck right in that spot. It was awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Got to give myself a pat on the back. So on let's tell them about I'm the gonna, next day. I'm going to post it. I'm going to post it for you driving. Yes. I said, yeah. everybody want to see you being <laughs> our driver. Yes. So so, so the next day was, the next was the next day we went to Tulum. Yes, we went to Tulum. 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 Yeah, Tulum. Yes. Yeah, and which is so very much becoming it's becoming changed. commercialized. You got to watch it though. Yep. Some of the places that we had went a few years ago, we were able to get in for free. We'll tell you now, you're going to pay for everything. Everything. But we were lucky and we we found a little place where we could park this big Tina ball that big band. I got it in place. there. And we went, what was, what was the name of that place? Was it a Aiken or? Um, there no, it was, was a, a, yeah. a Canaan. I thought it was a Canaan. A Canaan. A Canaan. A Canaan. A Canaan. A Canaan. Oh, okay. I thought it was a Canaan. A Canaan. Oh, that must have been the place next door that had all the bird nests that we snuck into. Yeah. Later. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. But that was beautiful because yeah. no, so, no, no charge. No charge. You can actually just go okay, and, and so enjoy it. What was the popular one we went into and they told us? Rosa Negra. It was Rosa, Rosa, Negra. Negra. Rosa Negra. They're the charging like $35 for their yeah. beach club. And we weren't willing to play yeah. that. And, and Tulum has become so commercialized where you can't just go to their beach clubs anymore. You're going to have to pay. You have yeah. to tell them up front that you're going to spend $200. And we didn't want to do that. Was yeah. just, we've been to Tulum and before. Yeah. And this was on a Tuesday in the middle of middle the day. Of the day. This wasn't like no on one the on the weekend. beach. They didn't even have no one in their facility. And I'm like, no. really? So we and went next door. To pay $125 a person, $100 a person. Yeah, at least $100 a person. Yeah. We were like, okay, thank you. Aiken. We went to Aiken, which was another beach club, and it was $25 a. No, it was 20. Each person See? had to spend. 
spend twenty five. Yeah, so and we bought food and drinks, and that covered us pretty yeah. much yeah. for the most part. Yeah. Beautiful yeah. beach. We're able to kind of get our get our dancing on. We you know did wonderful some beach music, run. wonderful Beautiful. music. Great yes. a DJ, uh, you know, yes. a DJ there. Yes. We had our Lots own private DJ, shot. really, because yeah. she was just playing our right. music. <laughs> Lots right. of, you know, cabanas right. where we could, we, we really chilled in a really cool cabana yeah, really and nice. able to, you know, just kind of walk on and off the beach, which was really and, good. Um, they had a, yep. And they had a pool. Yeah, so yeah, if you didn't want to be in the pool. beach, you can just they go in the pool. They didn't have to get in the pool. I tried to get in the pool. It was so cold. I got in there. <laughs> <laughs> I, I kind of got in. Yeah, I, we I dipped my toe yeah. in. Yeah, it was it so was, cold. That water was cold. Jeanette yeah, can was, stand it. Yeah, I yeah. Say, it was, I mean, yeah, that was really it. good. So I would say that's another hack too, because Tulum has gotten so commercialized to where if you go, just know you're going to spend a lot of money. And if not, try to find these little out places where we went to, like a that Aiken, because that yeah. was really, that's a gem yeah. in Tulum. And, and don't accept the first thing, you know, if they say, oh, you know, hey, I'm going to, you just like they barter, hey, I'll just go down the street because, you know, especially during the mm -hmm. week, early in the day, you know, it wasn't a Saturday afternoon mm -hmm. or anything like that. You know what, right. don't pay those high prices, you know, look around. There's so many places you can go that are off the beach or there are just beautiful places that are like beautifully decorated places that you can go to. You don't have to pay those, you know, just come in and view our, you know, scenery type fees. And and everything yeah. is kind of blocked in a little bit more. If y'all noticed it within uh, Tulum, it used to be where you can like kind of walk. It was really more open. Everybody is really secluded where you have to go through a main entrance or something now, which I thought was, you know, really takes away from the essence of the, you know, the, the very natural hobo, you know, vegan feel that they try to pers pursue or, you know, mm -hmm. persuade us. And, 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 and I'll tell our listeners, we've taken pictures in front of this statue uh, this of this man in Tulum. And you can't even so see that anymore. It it. Sam Khan. <laughs> you can't get to him anymore. He's yeah. gotta pay. Yeah, you gotta pay mm -hmm. now. You can't you just walk pay. up there like. Remember, you used to kind of move, 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 move around throughout the beach. Yeah. And now <laughs> he was right they down the street. They literally picked him up and put him behind some gates. Yeah. <laughs> they <laughs> picked him up and put him behind some and gates. You can't get to him anymore. But no. let's tell him about how we went uh, next door. Yeah, to Cannon. Next door to where we were. Yeah, Cannon. And we Cannon. went up to those uh, bird oh, that's gonna be, Yeah, that's going to be We got a free tour. <laughs> yes, we sure did. And, so and, and, and we, it's not just I one now. There. Me too. Yeah, that was Yeah, that it's was not just one because I know we've been to Azulik. Now, Azulik is not like the, the, yeah. have the market on these bird mm -hmm. nests that you can sit in and have dinner and do all this. Now you can go to, they have quite a few. If we, when we looked around, they mm -hmm. were all over the place. Mm -hmm. They were, and they're really beautiful. So, Say the name again. Do y'all remember the name of the place? Canaan. It was a Canaan. 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 Okay. And she mm -hmm. and she said the cheapest one that you can get in a bird nest was just sixty dollars a person. Yeah. Much more. I remember we paid. Good. We paid. Remember because, we paid like fifty five dollars for a drink. At yeah, the last we didn't one. even get into a bird nest. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, we weren't even in the bird nest. Drink. Yeah. Right. Right. We was in the big, big bird's nest, yeah. but you know, like everybody but many other people. Yeah. It's yes. a private. Yeah. 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 yeah, so so, so that and was, it's beautiful. That was pretty cool. Yeah, it was very, very much a beautiful view. And I think from there we just kind of um did we uh we had lunch there, food was pretty good. Uh really but then good. we started making mm -hmm. our way because we had reservations later on that night. I think we were going over yep. to um uh another place. Where did Sam, we go? Sam, what was it? Uh it was the it was the uh, hibachi it, place. Hibachi? Some some bria or yeah, uh, yeah the 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 reef cocoa Sam, beach samurai yeah the yeah. yeah the reef yeah so the part as part oh. of our our, our uh, uh package we upgraded remember we gotta upgrade we gotta upgrade we gotta upgrade for twenty one dollars <laughs> we were able to upgrade get all of the uh, exclusives at the resort that we were at and then also get the hibachi mm -hmm. we're gonna yeah. celebrate for Tina's birthday. Yeah, but Ika, <laughs> talk about talk about that because you know people may not know that when you go in, we had a we had a specific type of all inclusive. Yeah, but there was an upgrade where you can get upgraded liquor, right. you top chef. Yeah, yeah. I kind of didn't realize it. We were all inclusive, but then they had another package that you mm -hmm. could have booked top in shelf to that premium, would allow premium. you to go to. Yeah, you can get premium liquors. You can go to some of the other reef resorts and have dinner. So we and ended spas. up just spending $21 upgraded. We was able to get top chef, top liquor. chef liquor. We went to 
the Reef Coco Beach. We actually we've been to the Hibachi before yeah. and yes. we wanted to do it again. So we yep. was like, okay, it's Tina's birthday. Let's let's go and do the Hibachi. The food was pretty good. You know, and it gives you all your drinks too, all your food, all your drinks. Yeah. 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 And we had a yeah. great entertaining. It was awesome. Yeah, yeah, and transportation. And you know, I do have to, you know, give a shout mm-hmm. out as far as our transportation. They were they went and parked our car and then we were able to take their transportation <laughs> to and from to the uh Coco Beach. So that was that was awesome. Mm-hmm. Beautiful beach. Um and funny thing, we always see it at night. You know, they had all the Christmas decorations and things like that. But we mm-hmm. I haven't mm-hmm. seen it in the daytime. I think that would be uh now awesome we have to see it. The next yeah. time. No. Yeah, but that was a wonderful experience. Yeah. I think the group and the ladies loved it. You know, they fit all needs, all allergy, all food requirements. And, you know, you know, they top you off with some champagne. And again, you just go right into, you know, the whole hibachi, uh, I guess, experience. Yeah. Yeah. We had so much fun and we've been posting a lot of pictures yes, on social lots. media and people been looking at them. And a lot of people been saying like, what? When is the next trip? I want to go. Wanna <laughs> Everybody go. wants to go. Oh my gosh. I'm so yeah. excited. I'm so excited. I think <laughs> they get to see our fun yeah. and even the group we were with was so much fun. Mm-hmm. So I can't, I'm looking forward to mm-hmm. or really bringing others with us. And you know, it's some really, we had some good clean fun and we really, we really yeah. meshed as a group. And um, I love small but I welcome, you know, many sizes, but or even just other travel groups join us. That yeah. would be really great. That This was really a beautiful experience for us to open it up and be. And then I want to say mm-hmm. thank you to our producer, Shaletta Brundage. Yeah. Thank you for supporting us and yes. for being there for us. And just for yeah, making right. this happen, for helping yeah. us make this happen. Yeah, I think that upgraded yeah. our even our whole experience because, you know, when we were bringing others, we, we definitely wanted them to have a good time. And I think, you know, mm-hmm. just the... The, the backing and having, you know, the sponsorship, it really helped us to, you know, yeah. show that experience mm-hmm. and show who the yeah. jet setting divas really are and how we do it. Mm-hmm. All right. So we, we moving on up and we, we, we gotta, we gotta put together our next trip ladies. Yes. So uh, we're ready. Come, you, so come and join us on the next trip. Where, where, where we going? Right. All right. Yeah, we gotta <laughs> listen so y'all can know where we going next. <laughs> right. And join right. us so, next year. Yeah. yeah. All right. I'm Jeanette. Okay. And I'm Yvette. And I'm Tina. And we are the Jet Setting Divas. Again, please go to our social media and look at all those wonderful pictures from our fabulous vacation. Have a good day, everybody. Tune in next Thursday when the Jet Setting Divas will tell you about another fun destination spot that you'll want to visit. For more on their excursions, log on to ShalettaMakesMeLaugh.com. You deserve more internet than what you get from just your cell phone. Get free high-speed internet at home, a $29.95 value, when you qualify for Internet Essentials Plus and the Affordable Connectivity Program. Enjoy more streaming, gaming, and video chatting on more devices for free. With unlimited data and a wireless gateway included at no extra cost. No fees, no taxes, and no annual contract. Connect to more of what you love for free with Xfinity and the Affordable Connectivity Program. Click, call, or visit a store to learn more.